So this is a loading technique to the side part of the leg. So that spans right where the knee bends to right where the ankle bends. What you're going to need is a ball and you're going to need a surface that you can sit on top of. Now there's two different techniques that you can use. The first technique is more of the seek and destroy. So I'm going to place the ball on the platform, place my leg right on top of that ball, and then I'm going to scan that area. I'm going to start off towards my knee and then I'm going to go towards my ankle. Wherever I feel more load, I'm going to hold it there. I feel it right there. So now I'm going to try to rotate my shin upward and rotate my shin downward. Wherever I feel more load, I'm going to hold that there. So the load is the more sensitive area. So I feel it right there where it's a little bit more sensitive. Now I'm going to destroy it. How am I going to do that? I'm going to add a little bit more weight on top of it until it melts and desensitizes. So now I'm going to just take a breath in. And when I exhale, I'm going to shift my weight a little bit more on top of that ball and hold it there until it desensitizes and melts right on top of the ball. After that, I can progress to find another spot. So again, I'm doing the exact same thing towards my ankle, towards my knee. Once I find a sensitive spot, I'm going to swivel my shin up or down. I feel more when I go up, so I'm going to hold that position. I'm using this hand to make sure I hold that position. Take a breath in, exhale, add a little bit more load and wait until it desensitizes. The second technique that you can use is more of the pin and stretch technique. So what I'm going to do is the exact same thing, find a sensitive area. I'm scanning that area going towards my knee and then I'm going towards my ankle. So now what I'm going to do is I'm going to sit up nice and tall. I'm going to swivel my shin up or down until I feel more sensitivity, which is roughly about there. So my shin is up. I'm going to hold that position. Now in order to stretch it out, my ankle will be moving. So from here, I'm going to point my foot downward and point it upward. And then I can do that again, point it downward or point it upward. Now sometimes you might feel a little bit more if you just move your ankle in a circle. Wherever you feel more sensitivity, you're going to hold that there. So as I start to make a circle, I feel it right there. I'm going to hold it there with my opposite hand just to support it and then just allow that tissue to melt and desensitize. 